Well, hello everybody. So this is a little run through this uh, little painting I did uh, in acrylic. Uh, when I paint at home inside the house, uh, I'm not allowed oil because it stinks. <laughs> so uh, acrylic will do. What I like to do as per usual is to not plan anything. I uh, really like to discover a painting as I'm going ahead, you know, just uh, putting paint on a canvas. This is a little um, eight by 10 canvas and work from imagination. You know, seldom will I use photos. I can use photos to remind myself how an animal would look or something like like that but I like to kind of uh, pull it out of my head if you will it's, uh, there's nothing wrong with using photos but I personally don't like copying photos I'd rather be out there in nature a lot of the time I think uh, I'd rather go with imagination and just uh, you know start from scratch and see where you go and with that process it's like a battle you have no idea if it's gonna work or if it isn't gonna work so you change your mind a lot and you will see in this image like if you look at the arm position and the leg position they will change a lot and I do that uh, when I paint digitally I just see erase, repaint, and the same with uh, acrylic or oil, I sometimes just battle endlessly the image. The thing about my technique is uh, I think it's akin to sculpting, like you put a, a blob of paint and then you add, remove, and then you change your mind, ah oh, this leg doesn't work, I'll put it this way, I'll put it that way. And sometimes I will erase an entire image and repaint from scratch, you know, keeping just one eye or something, or not even that, you know, and I like this process, you know, it makes it free and uh, dynamic. This is the first version I did and you can see I felt she looked like she was different defenseless and kind of frightened whereas here she has more confidence and I added some background and this is the run through this process I hope you liked it